Hey everyone, so um, first an update on my back. Uh, it's still a little wonky. Um, slept a couple more hours than I did the night before, so we're getting there little by little. Um, but as far as Irma goes, um, I actually feel a little bit better about the situation. Now they're still showing um, the entire state of Florida is still uh, in, in effect, but um, they're kind of showing that the spaghetti models are going to be coming up through here. So I'm thinking we won't get a direct hit. So I'm thinking there's not going to be a mandatory evacuation, which makes me very, very happy. But again, the answer is still, we don't know. We don't know. We don't know, but I'm definitely feeling a little bit better about the situation. I mean, now what they're saying is that it could even go up into the Carolinas. So it's just a wait and see. Um, so I'm waiting on my friend Anna to come over. She's bringing some extra food for uh, for my dad, who's also going to be staying with me. And um, just want to show you my outside area. So you'll you'll see one of the reasons why I I want to stay. It's an absolutely beautiful day in Florida. Um, sun is shining, looks gorgeous. But the reason why I came outside, I just wanted to show you. Everything here is poured concrete. Um, and I live in a in sort of the little corner area and I'm surrounded by a ton of other poured concrete, inclu including in the in my back alley as well. And we have a, an absolute ginormous building here. So, I mean, I'm, I'm feeling, look how big that building is. Um, so I'm feeling, I'm feeling fine. I'm, I'm really not that worried. My mom, by the way, was a little upset that, uh, that I said, <laughs> go with your gut. She just wants to make it clear to everyone. She doesn't know what her gut is saying. <laughs> so uh, that's the message from my mom. Eddie in my house, but I need to make room in my garage for my dad's car because he's going to be staying with So I just woke up from a little nap, um, back still hurting, so I'm just trying to get rest uh, whenever I can. The uh, two o'clock uh, announcement has just been issued, and so I I'm still confused about uh, about what I'm seeing. Um, initially, I was like, oh, okay, it looks like it's going to go a little more um, east of where I live, but um, I was just looking at this, and so I live uh, about right here. And, uh, yeah, well, you can see this is what they're calling for right now. But, I mean, still, look at this uh, this cone. It's, like, it's massive. They just called, it, called a state of emergency for uh, the Carolinas. So, you know, it's just a wait and see. So, in the meantime, I am still prepping. So, as far as, like, my food situation, I'm definitely, definitely covered. Uh, my friend Anna came over. She's actually going to be spending um, the hurricane with me as well as my dad. Um, so, yeah, I think we're pretty much prepared on that. Got a lot of frozen goods. You know, if I lose power, well, well, we'll just cook it up. Um, but one of my subscribers actually gave me a great idea, uh, and that was any of your used um, bottles of water, just fill them up, put... Uh, put them in the freezer so they're nice and cold and then later I can use this for uh, for Ollie if I need to my cat and uh, or myself um, but I got I got a lot of cases of water so I should be pretty good because I think I started preparing before anybody else did um, I've also got my little uh, I've got a charging station over here so I'm good on that. And then last but not least, um, I, I'm actually crockpotting some chicken so I can shred it and make, I don't know, chicken salad, throw it in some pasta, like whatever. Um, just easy stuff. So yeah, I think I'm, uh, I'm almost there. I have actually, uh, let me show you over here. I have a, the cutest little bird feeder. So I got to take this guy out, um, which kind of sucks. Uh, so yeah, I got to take the bird feeder out. Still have to take the screens out. Um, but I'm, I'm, I'm feeling more confident about not having to evacuate. So I think that's a, a good thing. I still think it's going to be a strong storm, but we'll see. I'm just going to keep watching it. The next update is going to be five o'clock. So we'll see where we stand with that. And my dear friend Anna helped me break down all the, the rest of the boxes in my garage. So 
Um, so I will be able to fit my dad's car, so that's a good thing. So thank you, Anna. All right, so Anna was nice enough. Uh, this Hi was guys. the one that helped me actually uh, do the garage, so uh, thank you again for that, You're Anna. Um, but we, they just came out with the 5 o'clock report, and uh, just to show you here, um, so it looks like it's still, still coming up, and uh, it doesn't look that good for us, but we're still holding strong and just getting ready. Anna's loaded us up with the food, as you saw earlier, and uh, now uh, both of us are kind of surprised about the, um, the timing of it, because I thought... It changed completely. It was supposed to be Saturday, Sunday morning, now it's going to Monday morning, so we'll keep, keep waiting. And we're both kind of waiting on our work to figure out what to do. Um, you've probably seen my car before. I have a little tiny uh, Mini, like a two-seater Mini. She luckily has an SUV. So I think on Friday night I'm going to take a Uber to work and hopefully she'll drive me home. Oh, well, of course <laughs> um, I won't let you disappear. So, yeah. Beach. Thank you. I appreciate that. All right. Let, let, I'm going to show you the uh, timeline. So it looks like uh, Saturday is when we're really going to start feeling some effects. We have uh, Sunday and Monday that are probably going to be pretty crappy. Hopefully we're prepared or almost prepared. Um, and I saw another cool trick. Uh, someone had just posted on Facebook that any of your valuables you can actually put in your dishwasher. So make sure you have all your, you know, as I always say, like make sure you do your laundry. But do your dishes and uh, any of your valuables that you need, uh, you can actually put in the dishwasher because it is airtight. So that's a good, uh, good tip. Mm -hmm.